What's up? I'm back for some more, some more action. I wanted to go over a couple things with you tonight. Uh, it's your grip, okay? It's one thing us golf pros try and never, never touch, because sometimes it's deadly. But ultimately, if you know what it does, then it'll help. So, what is called a neutral grip is the V, the V, it's upside down to you, but the V in your dominant forward hand, if you're a lefty, it's your right hand, if you're a righty, it's your left hand. If it goes straight up into your belly button, both these, then that is a neutral grip, right in the middle. Club face is gonna stay right in the middle, square, square, all we do is turn. Now, if you have a strong grip, your V is way over to the right, and the tendency is to close the club face at impact because it's a strong grip, adding strength to your shot, long and left. Not good. If you have it on the opposite side and your V goes up your right, uh, excuse me, up your left arm, it's a weak grip. And what happens with a weak grip? Exactly, you guessed it. The club face tends to stay open, way more loft than the club that you're hitting. Your shot will be higher, end up going to the right. So ideally, your grip depends on the shot. Could go either way. Some people like whatever's more comfortable for you, but knowing what will happen based on the way you hold on to the club is important. So take a look at your grip, check it out in the mirror and see. I like to send my V's up to my right elbow. I mean, uh, my right armpit, excuse me. And boom, then it's nice and little bit on the strong side. I tend to like to play a draw better than a cut. So I go a little bit over and there it is. It also allows me to keep it, the club on plane on my takeaway. And then I just get to turn, baby. Hope that helped. We'll see you soon.